Hi, my name is Don Vierdefalk. I'm a media producer and media technician here at the wonderful Kristianstad University. And I'd like to show you how the media systems in our classrooms and conference rooms work. So the first thing to do is to not look for a remote control. Instead, look for a white box on the wall with fancy buttons. It looks like this. Now press on to turn the whole system on. What happens then is th that the projector screen will automatically drop. So if it doesn't, in some rare cases, then there's separate switches on the wall for that. Or you might have to pull it down manually. And the second thing that will happen is that the projector and the ceiling will turn itself on. So now when the system's on, I'll show you the other buttons. Press PC1 to show sound and image from the stationary computer. Press PC2 if you have a laptop with you that you'd like to show the image and sound from. And then you also need to find this cable and insert it into your computer. That's a VGA. And there's also for the sound that you put in the uh, headphone jack. And also press DVD. VCR to show a DVD movie or a VHS tape or even play a uh, music CD. And then there's a mute button to turn off sound and image temporarily. To get it back on just press the same mute button again. So no matter what source you've chosen, you can always adjust the volume with the little volume knob, just like that. And to turn the whole system off, just press off. And that's pretty much all you need to know.